That's right. You know, in keeping with my personal policy to educate and enlighten the people of the Northwest, we have lesson number 344. Tonight, it's vocabulary. The word is success. Now, according to Webster, the word success is a favorable outcome resulting in the gaining of wealth, fame, or rank, etc., etc., etc. You know, according to that definition, I've got to be one of the most successful men in the world today. I've got it all, baby. You know, I've held the Pacific Northwest Heavyweight Championship, the Florida State Championship, the West Coast Pacific Heavyweight Championship, the World Tag Team Championship, the Southern Heavyweight Championship, the Austro-Asian Championship, the All Japan Heavyweight Champion. I've done it all. But you know, even my successes in the ring don't outweigh the success I've had outside the ring in financial matters. But you know, as successful as I am, there's always more that I want. And when you have success, it's harder and harder to maintain it. But I've managed to do that year in and year out. You know, there's another man enjoying a great bit of success who comes from the Northwest. His name is Billy Jack. Now, easy, 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 easy. Easy, easy. You see, it sets the man off. It sets him right off when you mention the name Billy Jack. Because he knows that Billy Jack is coming. Billy Jack supposedly wants a piece of this man. Believe me, Billy Jack, I thought you were a smarter man than that. I really, really did. This man is the greatest martial arts expert in the world today, bar none and nobody. There is no one who has ever defeated this man in any way, shape, or form when it comes to a martial arts contest. This man is from a long, long line of bred ninjas. His father, his grandfather, his great-grandfather, they were all hired assassins for the Shogun. Billy Jack, you're doing quite well for yourself in Texas. I'm going to tell you something, son. There's no sense in coming up here and messing with this man. Don't let your pride overrule your good senses. Let what this man did to you be a thing of the past. Just forget it and stay in Texas because you'll probably make a lot more money and you'll probably stay a lot healthier than if you try to get in the ring with this man. Conclusion. Do you have any questions? There is word, uh, Ed, that Billy Jack wants to come up here around the first part of February and he said that he would crawl all the way from Texas just to get in the ring. He may not crawl here, but I guarantee you, if he messes with me or he messes with Kindo Nagasaki, the black ninja, they may have to carry him back to Texas. Nagasaki! Ayaku! Billy Jack! Billy Jack! Billy Jack! You see, it sets that man into a frenzy like nothing you've ever seen before. I guarantee you that this man is going to come down so hard if Billy Jack decides he wants to get in the ring with him. Conclusion, final. All right. Um, That's it. That's the word from uh, Ed Wiskowski. We will be right back with more right after this. <laughs>